So, the Super Mario 3D Collection, uh, Super Mario 35th Anniversary Collection, what have you. It goes by many names right now. A lot of Nintendo fans are speculating that we're going to get a celebration of the 35 years of Mario uh, since his debut. And by that they mean they want uh, three of those big Mario 64, Super Mario Sunshine, Super Mario Galaxy. Um, apparently they're omitting the second Galaxy, which... Sure. Uh, <laughs> But they assume that they're all going to bundle these together into one neat, almost uh, Super Mario All-Stars uh, collection of these three games. Um, personally, guys, I love the idea. Uh, Super Mario 64, well, really, like Super Mario 64 and Super Mario Galaxy, they're up there as like the... Um, my favorite games, man. I mean, they're some of the best platformers. I wasn't too big on Super Mario Sunshine, admittedly. I need to give that another try. Um, I think in my older age, I might appreciate it a little bit more so. But um, I, I haven't had a chance to really revisit that. But those are some of the best games ever. <laughs> and a Super Mario Collection, as great as it sounds sounds very un Nintendo and then on the other hand that's very Nintendo is to do just the complete opposite of what we expect so if it happens great I love those games I'd love to play them again even if it's just a straight port but uh, people are also speculating that they're gonna clean up like these games and like HD remaster fix cameras and I don't, I don't see them doing a collection and then fixing up all these things, um, especially since Nintendo uh, recently, I mean, on the Switch they did Link's Awakening uh, remake, great game, I love the original Game Boy, Link's Awakening, it's fantastic, um, the Switch remake is really good, um, but it's essentially a Game Boy game that they brought the switch <laughs> they made it look beautiful i uh, hands down it's still a fantastic game i mean really that game was impressive for the game boy anyway but they charged sixty dollars which is fine so that's the retail cost of these games but they charged sixty dollars for a game boy game that they ported and remastered and remade which fair enough i mean uh, it it is that took it the blueprints and like ramped it up to 11 I that's a Game Boy game that they moved to switch so I can't see the same company who does all these ports they're doing Wii U ports and they're making bank off of them by doing like just taking the game and bringing it over to a new system and adding like a funky mode or a deluxe a new character or something and then charging $60 for that and Fans are speculating that they're going to take three of the greatest platformers of all time and put them on one game. I don't see it, man. <laughs> I don't see it at all. It, it breaks my heart because I would love to see Super Mario 64 uh, remastered. I want a remake of that game so badly. It's my probably my favorite game. I'd put it up there. Uh, Smash Ultimate, Star Fox 64, Super Mario 64. Those are my favorites. Uh, I mean, they're, those games are fantastic. Even today, they hold up extremely well. I, I still think Mario 64 holds up well. But it does have some issues. Uh, camera. Uh, visuals. It's definitely visually outdated. Um, but I'd love to see... I, I would take just a Super Mario 64 remake, you know? I don't know how they do it. Maybe even add, like, a Luigi mode that remixes all the levels up or... You know, give us a separate adventure, or expand the castle, or what have you. Um, I'd love to see that, but I don't see them, if they were to do a collection, I feel like they would just, like, take those games and just bring port them over. Kind of like virtual console uh, games and just port them to the cartridge <laughs> with no changes. And I think that would be kind of disappointing, um, to be honest. I could be totally wrong. Like I said, it sounds very un-Nintendo to slap three of their biggest games onto one cart. 
Uh, I know they did it with like Super Mario All Stars, but those are 2D games, and that was a long time ago. Uh, 3D games are a whole different like ballpark. I mean, you're talking a lot of work into those. Um, they're big, you know, they're pretty massive games. Um, and to slap them all on one cart, I don't see it, man. I'm sorry, I could be wrong. <laughs> I could, I hope I'm wrong. I, I love those games, Mario Galaxy. You know, I talked about Mario 64 being fantastic. It's one of my favorites. I've I've never had a better experience with a game than exploring Peach's Castle and Super Mario 64. But um, Mario Galaxy's up there, man. Um, I don't think a game has ever made me smile as much as uh, Mario Galaxy has. That that was just pure fun. And Galaxy 2 as well. I mean, Galaxy 2 is just a fantastic game, but. For some reason, the rumored collections are omitting uh, Galaxy 2, which I feel I kind of feel like they're a package deal. Galaxy 1 and 2, I have a hard time like debating which of those I I like more. So they're just they're both pretty phenomenal. Um, but I group them in one. Like when somebody says, "Hey, you know, do you prefer Mario 64 or Galaxy?" When I think of Galaxy, I think of Galaxy 1 and 2 together. I'd almost prefer like a if they were to do these like remakes, um, do like Super Mario 64 remastered and then do Super Mario Galaxy, you know, and just combine the two Galaxy games or something. But I, I don't know. I don't it's I don't think Nintendo would do it, to be honest. But once again, um, my opinion, I could be totally wrong. You guys probably know better than I, <laughs> you know, but l let's face it, Nintendo for all the good they do. They like money. I mean, they're business. They charge like 80 bucks for Joy-Cons <laughs> that don't even work. <laughs> Not to complain. I hate people that complain on the internet. Um, <laughs> or rephrase, continuously complain. Not a complaint, but a critique, rather. Um, but, it, you know, Joy-Cons break. Uh, <laughs> I, You know, I don't see it. I could be uh, totally wrong. And I hope I am. Uh... I think the best we're going to get is like Super Mario 3D World Deluxe. And I'm fine with that. Uh, if you haven't played that, Super Mario 3D World Deluxe, play at least three player co op because that is a phenomenal uh, multiplayer experience. It's like uh, 2D and 3D Mario, the best of, just kind of compiled into one. Uh, Miyamoto said it best when he said it's a 2D Mario game in 3D. <laughs> Paraphrasing, but. Um, I'm actually playing that with my family right now, and uh, I'm Luigi, my son's playing as Mario, and my wife is Peach, and we're having a good time, man. It's uh, my, Your family will betray you in that game. It will throw you under the bus so they can get the crown and to get the top of the flagpole, but <laughs> I'm rambling. Uh, but yeah, uh, you know, just my opinions on the Mario collection. If it happens, I'm glad to be wrong. I, I have to admit, I... I'd absolutely love it if I'm I'm totally wrong, but I don't see it, man. I think we're going to get a uh, Super Mario 3D World Deluxe is going to be the big thing. and It's going to sell a gazillion copies because it's Mario, and the Switch is like selling everything like hotcakes. But, uh, you know, let me know what you think uh, down below. Um, you know, in the comments, you can tell me what a jackass I am and uh, <laughs> how wrong I am about everything. I am often wrong. About a lot, but I know my Nintendo. That's <laughs> 30, 35 years of playing video games, Nintendo games. So, uh, but uh, you know, uh, let me know if you think the Mario Collection is real. Awesome. Uh, let me know what you'd like in, uh, you know, Mario Collection. I mean, aside from just the games bundled up, what specials would you like? Like a history of uh, Mario? Would you like interviews? Uh, you know, artwork? You know, I'd like to. I'd like to learn new things that I don't already know about the Mario uh, universe and like all the behind the scenes stuff. I'm always really intrigued with that. Um, but yeah, yeah, you let me know what you think. Um, my channel here, if you've watched this far, um, <laughs> had another channel before, which was doing pretty well. I was with a few other guys and, um, you know, for, for new ignorant folks, we were doing pretty well. We, we got up to like... 300, 400 subscribers or something, which is cool. I started this new channel. Um, the, everybody kind of did their own thing. So uh, 
kind of wanted to start this, but I've had a kid since. Um, but I would like to kind of pick this up and do this a little bit more and hopefully do like some live discussions and talk Smash Brothers. I like Smash Brothers. I like Nintendo, all things Nintendo. I'm a big kid with a deep voice. <laughs> so I like talking about video games, I like talking Nintendo stuff. So um, please subscribe. That'd be cool. We can talk about stuff in the future if anything happens. <laughs> anyway, let me know what you think about the Super Mario Collection. You guys take care. Thank you so much if you've uh, watched this whole 10-minute video. I, I do greatly appreciate it. Thanks, guys. Have a good evening.